I was watching Kevin Hart last night. He's talking about how his family ruined his mother's funeral, huh? Yeah, that just seems like a normal Saturday with my dumbass bunch. My two uncles single-handedly ruined my mommy's funeral. Single-handedly. Just them two. One of my uncles is an alcoholic. Full-blown alcoholic. This man's either turned up all the way to the max or he's down on the ground crying. His little heart broke. He's either crying or turned up, one or the other. The other one, he's a full-blown crack whore. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. I mean, you can't go left around it, can't go right around it. Boy's a crack whore. Uh, can't stop him. Can't stop, won't stop him. Jiggy, 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 jiggy. Smoke that rock. I'm gonna smoke that rock. I show up to the funeral home. My damn drunk alcoholic uncle is back there in the corner of the parking lot tailgating my mommy's funeral. I walked up. I was like, what the hell were you doing out here? Huh? You got this damn generator out here blowing smoke everywhere? What are you doing? He said, cat's zone. Huh? C-A-T-S. Cat's zone. We out here. This man started flipping hamburgers and hot dogs. He's got a full-blown grill going. He got a 42-inch plasma screen hooked up to his damn cigarette lighter into his car. I said, you need to shut it down. He said, you need to shut your mouth. Cats is on. Cats is on. I'm trying to turn up out here. I said, bitch, you need to t turn it off. You need to turn it off. Don't even turn it down. Just turn it off. So then I walk up, me and my buddies. I see my damn crack her uh, uncle standing there. I try to introduce him to my buddies. I said, uh, hey, Mike, this is Steven and this is Brandon. He said, y'all want a bump? This man was sweating profusely. Huh? Sweating profusely. I have never seen a man sweat that much before. Then this old woman just walks up out of the blue. Never seen her before in my entire life. She said, Michael, how are you doing, sweetie? I haven't seen you since you was just a little thing. He said, shut up, bitch. I'm on that white girl. Huh? Big bumps now. Do real big bumps now. It just walks off. I was like, what the fuck is going on? Did he just say he was on White Girl? Huh? That old woman looked at me and was like, honey, what is White Girl? I said, I don't know. The same way I don't know who the hell you are. I stand outside for five minutes talking to everybody. I walk in. My damn crackle uncle was up there standing beside my mommy's casket i said uh -uh, ain't gonna happen i know what's about to happen i walk up this man said what do you want andrew i'm trying to pay my respects here glory take your bump take a bump i said bitch you better not give my mother a bump she can't take it with her where she's going Hmm. Then my damn drunk ass uncle walks in. He's like, everybody! Started screaming. The cash just scored. Huh? Seven points. Seven points. It was good. Field goal was good too. I turned around. I said, nobody gives a oh shit. Huh? Nobody cares. Nobody. And then after the sermon, word for word, I wish I was making this up. Word for word, my uncle said, I got something to say. I'd like to say something. He walks up to the podium and was like, I got bumps for $5. $5. And then he just walks off. Sits right beside me. I said, as soon as we leave here, I'm going to catch you on fire. Boom, bitch. He said, you need to calm down. Huh? Calm down. Then he empties some in his hand and goes, Puff. You do that shit again. You got it in my eyeballs. Papa, I'm going to tell on you right now. Huh? I'm about to tell on I'm going to snitch on your ass. I'm going to snitch on you. You better lock it up. Lock it up. And my drunk ass uncle sitting right beside him was like, I'm going to mess her. I said, shut up, bitch. You're crying because you're missing the game. I'm about to get your ass in a headlock. Give your ass a nookie. Shut up.
He said, you're disrespectful. I said, spell disrespectful, you Dean. Spell it. So listen, whenever you think you have family problems, huh, just think you could have my stupid ass bunch. Be, be thankful that you ain't got them two. Because huh? I'd trade them, I would trade my two uncles right now for two pit bulls and a cold Dr. Pepper. I got bumpies for $5. Shh.